In Evangeline Parish, the mayor-elect of Turkey Creek is facing a challenge that could prevent him from taking office. Philip Cavins ran unopposed and is set to be sworn in January 1st. Kendra LaFleur reports on the complaints against his candidacy and has reaction from the mayor-elect. Bert Campbell and private investigator James Bertrand are suspicious of mayor-elect Philip Cavins' eligibility to hold the office. This is not legal what you're doing. Yeah, uh, you're not, you're not a citizen of Turkey Creek, at least you wasn't on the day that you qualified. And now you say that you live, you've been living here over a year. I know you bought the house, the house a little over a year ago, but you have not lived there. And I have witnesses and affidavits signed saying that you were not living there. Campbell and Bertrand allege Cavins lived outside of the village limits and changed his address the same day he qualified for the election and say they have paperwork proving this. If I had to take a guess, I got about 15 statutes of the law that he violated. I believe there's a fix up. There's a lot of suspicion thing going on. We looked through documents given to us by Bertrand and Campbell. Two documents show Cavins with a P.O. Box address in Pine Prairie and that he voted in elections there in 2016. Cavins admits he's never voted in Turkey Creek, but says he is qualified to be mayor. The fact that I'm being accused of buying a house just to run for mayor, I think is um, slightly ridiculous because it's... That's a lot of work just to run for mayor. In June of 2017, documents show Cavins declared homestead exemption at the Turkey Creek address, which is what most courts use to show a voter's permanent address. I signed my homestead exemption, I believe it was June 13th, and I actually moved in June 15th or 16th at my house. Um, the water records in Turkey Creek show when I got it turned on. And you can see the fluctuations. It's not always the same. You can see I'm using water and electricity over there. Cavins admits he was raised just outside of the village limits, but moved last year. I respect the community's um, choice and ability to attempt a recall, but I pray for the chance to prove myself to each and every Turkey Creek voter to um, Prove to them that I can be a mayor that this community will be proud of. In Turkey Creek, Kendria LaFleur, KTC TV3. About